Hi everyone. So this is a continuation of a story that I've been telling you about a little girl um, that for a year tried to be in choir class in 10th grade, um, trying to be invisible and not um, have anyone find out that she can't sing or see the board. And the young girl that um, was traumatized by this game of Antakshiri um, because it involved singing. And then she started working. She started working as an engineer. And somewhere down the line, she decided, oh, she really wants to learn how to sing and dance. So she decides to go to India and uh, join an amazing school called Kalakshetra. So Kalakshetra is known for dance, and eventually she does um, study dance there. But in the beginning, she actually joins for music, to, for vocal, for singing. So she gets admission, she's in the school, she's sitting on the first day of class with a group of about seven other people and the teacher. And they're sitting in a circle, they're talking, and then the teacher just says, you know, sing a song. Very casually, and everyone's like, oh, okay, what kind of song? You know, and her heart's racing, and she's sweating, and she's terrified. And everyone's taking it so casually, like, oh yeah, let's just sing, we'll just sing a song. And, and she cannot control these sensations happening in her body, um, which is the same sensations she experienced before in that game of Antakshari and, and many years before in that choir class. And at this point though, she's like, no, I want this, so I'm, I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to sing. So she didn't actually do it in those other two instances. She didn't sing. But here she said, you know, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. So one person sings a song, beautiful. Um, I think some Malayalam song. And next person, next person, like one by one, they're singing a song, but all of them nice. And she's trying to think of a song. She doesn't know any songs, even because she's not, she never sang. But like just recently she had gone for a yoga course and they sang bhajans there. So there's some very simple uh, bhajans. So there's this um, Yamuna Thira Vihari. So she liked that song. So she was going to sing that song. Not that she can sing it well, but it's a pretty simple song. And so she said, you know, uh, and she's been doing it in a group setting at the center, never on her own. Uh, but as a large, like, you know, 50, 100 people together, uh, they'd sang that bhajan. So then it came to her turn, her heart's racing, she's sweating, and she's just, she can't think. But she opens her mouth to sing, and just tears. She has her mouth open, but just tears are coming out of her eyes. Just tears. She really, really wants to sing, but all that comes out, instead of any note, is just tears. And, and she keeps telling her mind, no, you, you got this, it's a safe place. And they all tell her it's fine. It's fine, you don't, you know, we don't expect anything, just sing anything. And she opens her, and again, just tears. And they said, it's okay, you know, you just, you just wait. Uh, we have two more people and we'll finish them and come back to you. And she says, okay. And they're very kind, very safe place. And so they go to the next two people and they finish thinking and in that time she's preparing her mind, you know. It's fine, it's no big deal, even if you mess up, it doesn't matter, it's a safe place, only a few people and, and you've done this in a group setting and it comes back to her and she opens her mouth and the same thing, just tears. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> so again, that... The story of that little girl, um, young lady, is, is me and um, I think probably the, the last story in the series that I want to share with you, uh, just to explain, you know, that fear uh, sometimes builds up over the years and so therefore takes some time to leave us. Um, but there's no reason for it to be there in us. Absolutely no reason for me to have this fear. Um, so yeah, these stories are not of any use, <laughs> um, they're not meant to entertain you, they're not of any use unless I'm able to inspire you uh, to face some fear of yours, something you really do truly want to overcome. Uh, so I hope, I, I hope these stories are, are doing that. Uh, yeah.
the world is waiting for each of us to become more fully ourselves and to share that with, the, with each other um, and not like a smaller, smaller version of ourselves that, yeah, not of any use. <laughs> so, yeah, I hope you find the courage to, to do that. Let's take a deep breath together. Inhale, letting the abdomen rise, letting the chest rise. And exhale, pulling the abdomen in, letting the chest fall. 